All reactions are available on Patreon, or if you want, you can pull up your copy of regular show episode 32 of season 4, Blind Trust, and press play on it when I press play when the timer reaches zero. Or you could leave. Or you could stay. These are your options. Are they going to be putting their blind trust in pots? Somebody who is who they wouldn't expect to lie usually. <coughs> I I actually I, I don't know about Rigby, but Mordecai definitely could have gotten it. Ooh, is this another Pops gets upset at Benson for riding on a... What? It's a trash bag. E e like when uh, Mor Benson was yelling at them a bunch. Oh, a blind trust exercise. Done. Yeah, I better not screw this up. I mean, it would suck, but worst case scenario, you just land on your ass. I feel like this is beyond your scope as a boss. <laughs> Flying car. Awesome. Why why are they leading him across logs? Uh, not logs, stumps. Yeah, oh come on. <laughs> Come on, Benson, you had one job, not look like an idiot for five seconds. That's awesome. <laughs> it it's better than that. What we're we're really doing this? What the heck? I will say this much, it's been a while since we've had an episode that really focused on them actually slacking, so I wonder if they've gotten a little better, but Benson doesn't really see it. And what they're doing here is more mistakes than trusting, which is fair for the trust issue factor, but the slacking? No.
<laughs> used as a cane. No. Okay, okay. Now Benson ignores them. Yeah, Benson. Why they wouldn't do that. That's beyond the scope of what they'd say. Now you're just being obstinate, is that the right word for this? Alright, uh, up to now, I could sort of see his frustration and struggle. That was just him being flat stupid. Is he gonna think they're just doing a voice? <laughs> How would he make his voice echo like that? Oh god. <laughs> Come on, you really, you guys suck at this. Really? Everything that's happened to you guys, that's what broke some bones? At least he's... Yeah, <laughs> come on. Not if you don't move. To be honest, as poorly as they've been doing in this whole thing, I, I still think Benson might be better off on his own. Just from a pure luck perspective. So he lied to get him to do something? Yeah, that's helpful. They lived. Oh. They're alive, though. And somehow, well, somebody's walking. This is, this is awesome. Some freak the mighty nonsense here. Okay, at this point you'd think the animals would be noticing just how absurd this situation is and step back and be like, maybe we're being the crazy ones here. Okay, okay, how is he- how is he making all these movements based on that little information? Okay, oh, okay. Rigby's doing the monkey bar part. <laughs> See, like, this is what I'm talking about. Mordecai and Rigby are clutch in, in the craziest of situations. If they could just apply that to regular situations, they might be fine. Oh, 
I mean, they just jumped off a cliff. They can, they're fine. You can't make the danger, you can't make it more dangerous now. I wonder if Benson's gonna think all this was fake, somehow. Fuck you! Help them survive it! Aww. How did he know? <laughs> I'm allergic to ham. Trust broke it. <laughs> yeah. Pops was kind of... Kind of bogus in this episode, but it, it was it was awesome. <laughs> the, that ending sequence made it all worth it. Next time. <laughs>